video I'm gonna show you how to operate the Samsung um, flex wash you have to press the power button on to unlock the front doors front or load door sorry here I'm gonna be doing some laundry to show you how to operate it I'm using pods and if you're using uh, detergent powder you also put it inside the drum but if you're using liquids there are specific containers for them on the very right side you can see softener and then beside it is the liquid bleach and then on the other side is the liquid detergent make sure not to overflow your liquids because it may um, damage your washer okay so these are the ones for the liquids and then it's very easy to operate because you just have to press what settings you want to use for your laundry here i'm gonna be using towels since i put some towels inside yeah i'm just pressing them and then it is locked it automatically chooses how many rings what is the temperature the spin of the drum is it high um, mo moderate medium sorry low or no spin and also how many rinses if it's very soiled and then to turn it on you have to press the start pause button 
you have to hold it for at least three seconds i am done with the first load this is the second load again you have to press the power button to unlock it i'm getting the laundry so this holds a capacity of 6.5 um, cubic meter so it's good if you're a big family so you save a lot of water um detergent fab softener and then also electricity and water so yeah it's a good buy so we don't have that much laundry when it's summer but in winter i know it will be a lot so this is really good i also used the top load here one of the doors inside is the main door for the washer and the other door is outside i think it is used to protect the machine so nothing will go inside so on the uh, top load i washed the underwear and some face towels that we have used so this holds i think one kilo of clothes you can uh, wash one jeans here um, two adult shirts um, three kids shirt and there are also um, containers for your liquids this is for the bleach liquid bleach and on the other side is your fab fabcon or softener so that side it has no protection so that's why there are two covers and we have to make sure that we don't overflow our liquid that's why there's a a lid there for your liquid so to make sure to ensure that it will not overflow in the machine and the detergents go right on top right inside the washer you have to make sure that you will hear a snap when you close the washer door i think i didn't uh, lock it properly so later you will see that it detected a problem so i put the lid there so it won't overflow so you have to press the power button and then choose your setting so again it will automatically choose everything for you the temperature how many rinses how long it will run but yeah when i pressed the start button which says hold to start again you have to press it for three seconds at least it says ldc4 and it means the washer door was not properly locked so it won't operate so i turned it off i turned it on and then i made sure that i locked the door or i closed the door properly and there you go it's good and it's working um this uh washing machine can also be operated through uh the app called smart things later you're gonna see it so i'm opening the front load because i'm not gonna use it just to make sure that it will dry up because uh, one of the problems of the washing machines is that when it's been used for a long period of time it accumulates smell so to make sure that your washer will not smell you have to try this part especially with the front load washing machine and then you have to leave the door open to ensure that it will dry and it will not have any molds or accumulate any molds i just watch um that 
from a YouTube video as well because our washer before had a, a very foul odor that's why we bought this one so this washer is really a good buy especially if you are a big family like us we got this um, washing machine um, the price is almost half only in our town or city and then another town and I will be showing you um, the app it tells you when the cycle is already complete it's called smart things so it notifies your phone and then it tells you that because it's done it's offline now I'm just showing you uh, how the, the app looks like so we only have one device here because we do it's new to us and we don't have a lot of smart appliances yet and then you can also see the history so we only have the washer here and then the notifications so if you have other smart appliances you can use smart things i think it's mostly samsung appliances that you can connect with this one so i think um that's all thank you very much for watching have a good day and god bless everyone